Mike, you're here with your children. Uh, smile on your face after an incredible performance. What does it mean to you on your last game beating Fiji at the Rugby World Cup? Uh, obviously, uh, I can die tomorrow. It's going to be an awesome, awesome day for me. I retired after the World Cup and to finish like that, it's unbelievable for me. And what about this team? You know, and the friendship that you formed with the Portuguese-based players and the French-based players. How special are these, are these great? Uh, that's our, our, it's our strength. Some players, some amateur in Portugal, some professional in France. And we, it's four years we build this and we are happy today we, we win this game to pay uh, ourselves. And what about the future of Portuguese rugby? When you see a performance like that, you must you know, think that there's a positive future. Yeah, I hope the, the future is going to be well for us because we deserve it and to continue to, to work on the, on the good way to, to the next generation. Have you got a couple of things you'd like to say to these fans here because they have been absolutely incredible? Yeah, yeah, thank you so much. It's really awesome to play here because a lot of Portuguese come to, to watch the game and support us all. All the game we listen to Portugal, Portugal. So for us, it's going to be awesome. And thank you so much. Thank you a lot. And you had a lot of Australian fans, you know, who were behind you as well today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, we know. <laughs> thank you. Merci beaucoup. Thank you very much. Ah, lovely moments. He can die right now, he says. No one wants that to happen. But boy, it just sums up what a win over Fiji at Rugby World Cup means to that man to his family, to his friends, to his teammates, to the country of Portugal.